It's August 21st today, about 10.30 a.m. You know, it's just starting to warm up, so I'm going to crank on the fan. Still running the system in continuous flow. You can see down here into the sump, it's just, you know, just running, not getting too much buildup of anything. Swirl filtration, you know, it's still just running and keeping things moving along. Yeah, this strawberry didn't do so good on the transplant. This guy's looking pretty good, and so is this guy. Uh, not so sure about this one here. Um, the tomatoes, they are all just shooting up. You can see where the stunted part of the plant growth was on all of them, and where the new part is that's growing since they've been placed in the aquaponic system. So. I would say most of them have more than doubled in size and you know that's in about a two week time frame. The green onions just getting taller, tall as can be. The uh, lettuces are growing, they seem to have taken to the transplant. I'd like to see them grow a little faster but you know they're just doing what they can do. I've had some bugs getting in here eating some things. Anybody that knows how to make some organic pesticide mixes, let me know. I'd like to be able to put something in the system to try to deter some of these bugs. I do have June bugs, and I did have some grasshoppers that had gotten in here. And if you take a look at the lettuces, these are just stumps that were left over from the store. This was bright yellow, now it's gone dark green, and it's sending leaves out. Let's take a look at the fish. Still got crystal clear water in the setup and been feeding the fish a little bit of worms and uh, still feeding them the uh, Wardley pond pellets. I mean, you can see how little this can is. They're, they're consuming about maybe, maybe 10 pellets a day now. You know, they'll come in and munch on them and munch on them until they kind of dissolve them up. And then I just supplement them with worms a little bit. So other than that, everything's working well in the system. All the siphon changes that we did, they all seem to make a big, a really big difference in the setup. And uh, I think I need more fish to get the, the growing to take place a little bit faster. I think that's kind of where we're getting is at a point where maybe we need a few more fish in the system. Anyhow, um, Still haven't added to these grow beds yet, but that's on the list of things to do. We'll just keep working it in. Everything's going really well. Um, did check the pH, and I brought it down a little bit with that pH down. I'm going to put a little bit more of that in today. And we'll keep trying to drive that pH back down a little bit. Uh, the growth, I just cannot believe that I could take a dead plant out of the ground in August, you know and stick it out here in this system and then have it shoot up and grow a whole new plant out of it. Anyways, pretty neat little system. Uh, thanks for watching.